I remember, uh, I think this is how I explain how, how much I was uh, raised and, and bred to be a, a Sooner. One time in front of my grandparents, I just happened to mention that my favorite popsicle was the orange popsicle. And uh, I remember almost, I mean, that was probably top two or three times my grandparents, my grandma kind of like gone on to me a little bit. And for some reason, that was kind of a big deal to, to not like the red one as much. And she just wanted to make sure that I was properly educated on um, it was always red over orange. I never visited Norman. I'd never come to, to Oklahoma before. And I Googled, you know, oh, you, you know, what's so great about the University of Oklahoma? And the first thing that popped up is a YouTube video of the Pride. I was like, oh, they have an amazing marching band going to that school. One place I love to go is actually the top of the parking garage by the football stadium. Uh, the very top parking spot uh, has written on it in paint, be ready. Uh, and for some reason, it's always just stuck out to me. Whenever I, I need to think or get away, I'll go up there and park and just look out over campus uh, at night. And, and campus is beautiful at night. All the lights are lit up and all the sidewalks and things. And, and it just kind of tells me to be ready for whatever, whatever it's going to bring, whatever life's going to bring. Uh, it's probably my favorite place on campus. Like, as a freshman, I would have never, ever, ever skipped class. Like, I had friends who skipped class, and I was appalled. I thought it was so disrespectful to the professor and to the money that you were paying. And, and somehow, along the line, I have, like, become this person who I, like, rationalize time differently. And I, I think that that's kind of the value in college, really, is that you start to see that your black and white lines become much more blurred. And so, you know, skipping class to do just silly things or, you know, to just sit on a patio because it's the first sunny day in spring um, rather than going to your 1.30 class um, has been just special. And the conversations that come out of those moments or, um, you know, deciding to go on a hiking trip of a weekend that you just know you should be doing something else um, have, have really been monumental for, for knowing, for me to know what friends really mean and just those experience and how to value those as well as the successful and academic and, and more prestigious moments. You are not in this alone and this whole OU experience is going to be so much bigger than you once you reach the end. It'll be so much bigger than just you. Um, so take that to heart and um, do this experience like like such and you know just make sure that you leave a legacy here because everybody has the opportunity to so realize that you're not in it alone um, it's going to be much bigger than you so um, don't take that for granted one of my favorite traditions on campus is the ringing of the bells um, from the clock tower i think it, it really signifies your short time here on campus and while sometimes if I'm running late to class, it reminds me that I need to hurry, um, it's also a reminder of the time that you have left and how precious that is, that you need to spend it with those who are close to you and that mean a lot to you. And so I really like the symbolic aspect of it, not only that it tells the time, but also that it's a reminder of you should really invest your time in what means a lot to you and what's really going to give back to yourself and to others. I would say that to each and every person, whether you're a transfer student, a new student, or you are just in the middle of your journey as well, uh, look at the people around you and not only meet them, but get to know them. Take advantage of the friendships and the resources that they have to offer for you because I'm telling you that you will meet someone every single day that somehow will help guide you in making you a better person and making you stronger than you were before when you entered uh, to the university uh, your freshman year. So take advantage of that and, um, and live it up. These are the best years of your life and I am uh, I'm so proud to be a Sooner. To say live on university, to know that, that while we're all here, we are uh, very finite in a, in a very big, big and larger picture than us. And so to, to end the song with live on university, um, to me, uh, says that, you know, this is, it's going to go on much longer than I will. But if I can have a very short and vibrant time during, while I'm here, uh, the university is going to go on and, and live to tell better stories than I could ever do.